We just launched into a table at Mahjong time. In this strategy theory session, we're going to be playing American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you're new to this game, there's a link in the video description below to a lesson playlist. That way you can learn the fundamentals. Also, if you'd like to play at Mahjong time, look for my email in the video description. Send me an email and I can send you some information on their VIP trial. Let's see what we can do with these tiles. We've got a pair of twos and a pair of sevens. This will be interesting because you cannot do anything with a pair of twos and a pair of sevens. So we have to choose one or the other. There are, I think, more opportunities for sevens and eights than there are with twos and threes. Two, three, four. Let's let the west go, the two, and the four, and focus on five through eight. I usually pick a range of four to five numbers around the multiple. So let's see how this goes. Four, north, mm, either way it's going to be risky. We're building around the seven dot. We could maybe do something with odds. One, three, five. We do have sevens. One, three, seven. We'll see. I think six, seven looks better. Maybe even a pair hand if we can get flowers. Seven, eight, seven, eight. We need an eight dot if we're going to try a pair hand. We did get odds. One and five. So let's pass the east and the two. We still have odd potential in six, seven, eight, nine. We have a seven, seven, eight, seven, eight. We have to make a choice. Five, seven. I don't think all these fives are going to help in this case. Let's let the five bam go. I was thinking that we may be able to play the concealed odd hand. Oh, now here's an eight. We do have evens there, but here's an eight, seven, eight, seven, eight. All right, that pair hand is looking a little better at this point. Let's just pull five, six, seven, eight together there. We'll definitely keep going. I think so. Seven, eight. If we can get an eight dot, that pair hand might work. That would be the third hand down under singles and pairs. But we have a gap, no flowers. That's a bit risky. Here's a nine dot. There is a consecutive hand that uses a pair with two consecutive pungs, the concealed hand. All right, now this is going to be a little risky with one, two, three, and one suit and a four dot. At this point, let's let the five go. We do have five, seven, seven, nine, but our pair is with the eight and the seven. So let's pass one, three, four. So we have seven, nine, seven, eight, six, seven, eight. And we got like numbers with twos. That's not going to work. We got the two back there. Look, two dot. <laughs> okay, so let's give up on the east and the five. Seven, eight, seven, eight, nine. There's that hand right there. Seven, eight, seven, eight, nine concealed, and we got another nine. All right, now we've got like numbers with twos and a one. I think we could let the six go. Let's pass two, one, and six. We have seven, eight, seven, eight, nine. We'll put them in order though, and with their suit. There we go. Mixed suits is better than one suit with that one, two, I think. Oh, we got a seven. That's a keeper. And we have tiles we can discard here. 
Let's let the twos go. Two dots. So we have seven, eight, seven, eight, nine. No gaps. Concealed hand. Four characters. We could maybe use these seven dots as Four joker bamboos. bait. If you want to know how joker bait works, there's a link in the video description below Each to wind. some demonstrations. Joker bait is a term that is coined by Tom Sloper Two of characters. Sloperama. And basically, you keep a Eight pair dots. that you may not need until the middle of the middle wall. Six characters. So that would be the third wall, middle of the third wall. Six and then you would characters. discard one. When you discard that one tile, Four somebody characters. might make an exposure with a joker on your next turn. You make the exchange. One so we have a little change in here. We have a pung Green of sevens dragon. now. So we have a pung of sevens. We have six, seven now. Six, seven, eight. So let's just keep it all. South wind. We have a discard. There's an eight. Seven, eight, Green seven, bamboos. eight, nine. No gaps. I think the seven dots are going to have to go. We'll just hold on and see what comes in. Two bamboos. We still might even be able to play that seven, eight pair character. hand. Third hand down under singles and pairs. Five characters. West wind. I think the six dot can go for sure. Eight dots. Oh, that's the second one. I don't think that pair hand's going to work. Characters. We have a gap, and the, there are two out of that eight dot. That's not two looking good dots. for the pair hand. Oh my goodness, look at what we got, a six. Six, seven. We don't have the right tiles for it. I'd let it go. Six dots. Even this seven, I think, is going to have to go. There was hope for that pair hand, but with hmm. two eight dots out, I don't think so. Unless Green we draw characters. an eight dot. Oh, there's a flower. Six dots. All right, well, maybe. Nine bamboos. If we can get an eight dot and another flower, we might be able hmm. to do it. Green dragon. A joker. So I would not play that pair hand now. I would use that joker. So we need to let this flower go right away. White dragon. We don't want to hold on to that for too long. You want to get rid of any Green risky characters. tiles like flowers, twos, and white dragons. Chrysanthemum. Before the end of the third wall, really. Nine characters. So we're still in the middle game right Eight now. Characters. Oh, we're we're concealed. So right about I'd say right about Bamboo. where this yeah, right about where these flowers are, that's when we need to discard these risky tiles. Well really we just have one right now. Bamboo. And they're all being discarded. Nobody wants them. So we'll let it go. Chrysanthemum. So we're looking for a pung 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 pair. We got our pair right there. All we need to do is build up these seven eights. Seven bamboos. That's one of our tiles, but we're concealed. Two characters. So we will need a joker for that. Now this player to our left. Two bamboos. It looks like, let's see, twos are out. Two characters. Five, Pung of Fives, Kong of Nines. They could be playing the first odd hand. West Wind. I think that's the only hand they could be playing. Seven Dots. That is the only hand they could be playing, actually. In that case, they may they they could have a pung of sevens, nine bamboos, or a pair of sevens because there's a seven out and we have one Six too. Dots. So I think they are going to need sevens, two characters, but they're not going to get the one in our hand. We're going to use it. North wind. 
So they're gonna need a, they're gonna need two jokers Why for those again? sevens. White Dragon South Wind Looks like nobody's playing wins. They should all be safe discards. One dot. And probably again around Green these bamboos. flowers. We might even consider holding those wins for safe discards. Two bamboos. Four bamboos. This is a keeper. Nine dots. Pass. That's a pair for us. Nine dots. We're good there, thankfully. One bamboo. Okay, one crack. Sevens are out. These are all out. Seven dots. West wind. Five characters. Nine characters. White dragon, that should be safe. <clears throat> White dragon. Three characters. South wind. Seven characters. Oh, we're concealed. We got a joker. Seven we dots. might need that for that seven ban. Okay, now there's one of each of the seven and eights. Hum. So we're one away from ready. Five characters. It'd be very nice to draw another seven bam. Or good. Or seven eight crack, of course. Six no bamboos. six bams are out. That was kind of scary. We're in the end game. Seven oh, there we go. We're concealed. Pass. So we're going to need those there. Eight dots. I'm thinking they probably have one of the sevens. So we're going to need a joker, seven, eight, crack. Joker or seven, eight, crack. One bamboo. They need that tile. Not ready for it. That was the second one. There are North two. Wind. There are two, three bams out also. Four bamboos. We need one more tile to get ready to win. Four bamboos. Oh, we got a joker. All right then. One character. We're ready on a seven bam. Four characters. Seven crack or eight crack. One of three tiles. Six bamboos. And two players I know don't need those tiles. Three dots. The player across from us Four and the player characters. to our left will discard those tiles. The player on the right, I don't know what they're playing. North wind. So it's a guess. Let's see. East wind. They have a lot of odds and big evens. We have a Eight pretty character. There we go. We got it. Mahjong. Mahjong. Six, uh, seven, eight, seven, eight, nine. So we have the concealed consecutive run hand. Pung, 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 pung pair. Seven, eight, seven, eight, nine. All right. So let's see what everyone was playing. Here we had news with dragons. News with dragons. Okay, a lot of number tiles in front of them. Not, but they had a couple of wins in here, so I wasn't, I wasn't thinking they were in a wind and dragon hand because they had wins. But they only need news for the second hand down. And then this player, ooh, they were ready to win on a one dot. Ready to win on a one dot. This was a close race here. One, three, five, seven, nine. They had no seven bams. They had a gap. That would be the gap hand, but they did define one of their jokers. They needed another seven bam or another joker to get ready to win. Thankfully, we had jokers for our sevens. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. 
click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.